Okay, hey everybody, once again, Red Shredder 106 here, and I am excited today because I have just received the D-Plus CX-6. Here's the box. Yeah, uh, brand new box, everything and stuff, la 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 la. Um, but here's the gun. Yep, <laughs> I love this gun so much. Um, it's it's the most unique gun that Nerf has ever made. It's and the best part is not reverse plunger. Uh, so many pe people are cheering right now just because it's not reverse plunger. It's an awesome gun. And you actually can you actually see in there that it's not reverse plunger. So, uh, yeah, let me just cock this back up. Okay, so I'm gonna be talking about I'm gonna be doing a review on the D Plus CS6 tonight, and I'm gonna be showing you all the attachments that go with it, all the attachments that are on it, um, all the attachments that can go on it, um, and a firing test and bads and goods and stuff like that. Not in that order. So, yeah. Let's just go about over, over the overall gun. The overall gun is an awesome, uh, really awesome gun. Okay, here's its flashlight mode. Flashlight mode is a stealth mode. It's stealthy because Nerf wanted to make two modify missions, which was the recon, and this is the next one. So, uh, here it's, here's its flashlight. Yeah, it's a red flashlight. It's actually a really bright flashlight, too. And it's probably going to be just like the mission kit. Actually, I think it is like the mission kit. So, yeah. Okay, now here is what everybody just wants to see. So, yep. Transforms into a gun. Pretty cool. Uh, uh, let's go over uh, just its gun. It, I think it fires 40 feet. Haven't tested the range yet, but it goes further than the launch strike, which I did test, and it's much stronger than the launch strike. Not stronger than the launch shot, though. I don't know why. Uh, I still need to test that. Oh, and one thing that I have to show you guys: it has a scope. Yep, you guys can see that, right? Okay. Um, it's a great gun. It is. It has this handle, kind of like for the launch shot. And then you could carry it around, and then you could turn, change back into flashlight mode. And then it's like people won't know and stuff, but if you guys do like cops and robbers and stuff, like here's caught like cops with their flashlights, and it's just like so they don't have to change this to their gun. They do, psh. and yeah, okay. Um, so the instance that gun comes with it comes with a strap. It comes with one clip and six darts. Uh, does not come with uh, three AAA batteries, which you have to get for this gun if you want the flashlight to work. Um, has a jam door. It has the not notches in here, so you can put on extra barrels, which I will show when I get to attachments and stuff. Um, uh, and this, I like the name on it too because it disappears when you transform into flashlight mode. So yeah. Um, okay. I'm going to go over attachments now, so let's go over, I'm just going to do the barrels first. So let's go with the launch strike barrel first on it. Weird, but actually it's really kind of cool. And then the iron sight. Yeah, perfect alignment and everything. Okay, recon barrel. It looks like it belongs on there, but see if they got rid of the gray, it would be perfect for it. Okay, um, next is the Lawn Shots Barrel. This is just heavy and annoying. Okay, now let's go with the attachments, and I'm going to be doing the same thing that you guys saw in the Raider video. So, let's go that, that, that. Very unstable, it's a total skyscraper. And then, it's really unstable, see? So, yeah. Um, okay, I'm going to do one thing that it shows on the back of the box, which is right over here. Yeah, right there, see? Okay, here's the flip clip going on it. 
and then I have to re-get that scope. Oh, and for whoever's wondering, there is a little button to release the clip. So, yeah. Okay, here's what it looks like with the scope and the flip clip on it. Yeah, I like it. It's actually pretty cool. And then, um, let me take off this piece in my last video. Uh, got it hit it. So, yeah, there. And you could also fire it like this. You had to keep this, the stock out, though. Uh, you have to keep this. You can fire when it's like this. You can still shoot. So, um, uh, I'm just going to go over comfortness now. So, comfortness, uh, the stock. Not that comfortable since it's like that. So, I mean, it is comfortable just as long as you don't get jammed in the shoulder. Uh, yeah, it's still a great gun. That's like what makes it a 9 out of 10. See, if it had a better stock and a better curve and a better uh, uh, handle angle, it would have got a 10. It's a perfect gun. Um, see, right in there, you can... That is how you can tell that it is not reverse plunger. Uh, still a really cool gun. I love it. Um... Ooh, uh, I'm going to put the, a couple other sights on here so you guys can get a feel of what it's like. Uh, pinpoint. Launch strike. Mission tack. That looks pretty cool on it. And launch hot scope. Even though it has a scope in it, it's... You really don't need another scope on it, so I don't see why they put the tactical rail there, but I kind of see why, so that you can either put the laser on there, or you can put a pinpoint on there. Yeah, but still, a really great gun. It, I could fit it I could fit it in my hand right now, just like this. So, it's a small gun, but once it goes like this, you can still fit it in your hand, but it's it's an awesome, awesome, awesome gun. Whoever gets this will love it. Okay, I have to do a firing test before I run out of time. So, I'm going to be firing at the Launch Strike box. So, just look at the Launch Strike box. Not the Launch Strike, the Launch Strike box. Deploy. Fired one. Out of ammo. Okay. Yeah, so deploy 40 foot range. That's what I have to say. Um, I'm going to show you what it looks like with the Raider drum mag in it. There you go. Looks like that. And then lift it up like that. Close this. Heavy. That's all I have to say. And then, yeah, that would have been, ow. That would have been kind of dangerous right there. But I, it, that's pretty cool. And then when you go like that, that's pretty cool too. So, uh, I think I just, yeah, that just happened. Okay, there we go. Yeah, great gun, uh, 9 out of 10. Just about everything is awesome with this gun. And also, I got two. So, I'm going to have an unboxing video. Here's one of the boxes, and here's the other box. So, yeah, I'm going to have an unboxing video on the second one. And um, my friend and I, since we were in band together and we both, we all got the same shirts and stuff, we're on Friday, we're going to both have the deploy, and we're going to both have our uh, band shirts on, and we're going to be twin team. And then when we're on a major team, we're going to be called... Uh, the marzipan macadamians and then we're going to be then if it's just us and we don't have the same gun it's going to be uh, uh, team mandal yep so great gun 9 out of 10 everything on it uh, I think I showed you everything about it so that's just about it oh strap I don't think I told you guys about that it comes with the strap uh, that's just about 110 <laughs> 166 out peace